So there's some new information, really, I guess, rumors about Starfield and where you begin in the game. Downloading it, starting it, creating your character, and then what happens after that? Well, just like most traditional Bethesda RPGs, the rumor is that much like in Oblivion and Skyrim, you're going to be in this confined space, you wake up, you talk to a few people, you move through an environment, and then all of a sudden, you're thrust into this open large world where anything can happen the sense of wonder and exploration that's inherent to most of those bethesda rpgs morrowind oblivion skyrim fallout fallout new vegas the list goes on and on but that idea of you're a new character in a confined space and then you're thrust into this world where anything can happen a true role-playing game you can go anywhere do anything and of course there are going to be quests and stories and people to talk to but then you're going to add in that idea of much like in skyrim where you walk out into this large open world and it just feels like anything can happen and you can go anywhere well, on starfield you're going to have that feeling but then you're going to have to remember that everything that you're looking at up into the sky and in space is explorable so that feeling can be compounded thousands of times over again but i do feel it's important to give you that first initial sense of wonder you know i remember playing oblivion when i was in the jail cell and uriel septim comes and you walk through the dungeons and they get a little bit bigger a little bit wider and you know at the time the graphics were mind-blowing you know really cool and then all of a sudden you come out into that open world and literally it's a living breathing world and anything can happen you can go anywhere you can do anything there's a main story there's side quest there's things that just happen emergently because of that um procedural generation that did happen a little bit in oblivion a little bit more in skyrim and is happening a lot more in starfield but the first moments that your character ventures into that large world that's the feeling that bethesda styled rpgs I mean that's the feeling they give me and i feel like a lot of people love these type of uh these type of games because of that feeling and that is essentially this rumor that i've been hearing i've been doing a lot of research watching a lot of videos and i get the sense that you're going to start in this one hub world and then all of a sudden you're going to be thrust out into the world of starfield into your spaceship fly into space and not just that moment of i can go anywhere here but I can go anywhere, anywhere. That is what I'm excited about. Now look, I've been talking about Starfield for a while now. This is like my third video on Starfield. I'm genuinely excited about Starfield, not because of Xbox, PlayStation, Switch. I'm just excited about this style of role-playing game. I like linear style role-playing games also, wasn't hugely hugely in love with the latest final fantasy i know that sometimes the latest iteration of a storied franchise most people just need it to be the best version of that franchise i just don't feel that this version of final fantasy is the best there are a lot of issues with linearity there are a lot of issues with walking from here literally to here to talk to somebody then walk back to talk to the person again then walk back to them it just became a bit too repetitive for me However, I do really gravitate towards the type of RPGs that Bethesda makes. I like the idea of there's stuff to do, there's a story, there are characters, and it's very involved and detailed, but I can just exist in the world. I can go there, I can go there, and in between these spaces, there are these emergent things that happen. If you give me that, and then on top of it, pile in a thousand planets that are procedurally generated that i could explore at my leisure and get that sense of exploration landing on the planet looking at the sights the sounds even if there isn't much to do on those planets only 10 percent have life mimicking what we think happens in the universe i'm going to be very excited i am very excited about starfield so the idea that all of these games sort of begin the same way i like i like that idea of I'm in this space, I walk into an open world, and then it's mine to do with as I please. Let me know if you're excited about that possibility when it comes to Starfield. We're really close, really, really close to Starfield. I cannot wait. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.